Hey everybody, I'm doing something a little scary, a little dangerous today. I am going outside. Uh, today is the, uh, there's a fair going on called the Taste of Colorado. Uh, it happens every year uh, over Labor Day weekend and it's, uh, like I said, like a fair. But it's all about food and all the restaurants come out and you can buy samples of food or full food. It's all food uh, with some music and a few like uh, rides and stuff uh, built in. Uh, but it should be really fun. Uh, I always end up going to it and I figured I would take you guys along with me this year. So let's get to it. To the taste of Colorado. Alright, so the first thing I got uh, was like a uh, New Orleans uh, place. So I got some fried gator right there. Uh, if it'll focus. Yeah, fried alligator right there. Some uh, etouffee and then fried pickles. So let's give this a try. So a fried gator bit with uh, hot sauce. That's pretty good. Yeah, uh, the etouffee is pretty good. And we got a fried pickle. Alright, it's so the first thing I got. Yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, this is from a restaurant I have gone to a few times called Bayou Bob's. I haven't gone there in a while, but yeah. Fried gator is very good if you haven't tried it. Uh, I definitely love New Orleans cooking. Um, but now it's all kind of, not super spicy, but a little spicy. Uh, so now I'm thirsty. Let me see if I can wrangle up Ooh, there's some ice cream. Oh, that's just Briar's ice cream. I, if I'm gonna get ice cream here, it's gotta be something weird. Uh, so let me see if I can wrangle up a drink of some sort and uh, we'll see where that takes us. All right, I uh, got a soda from a Stubborn Soda. Uh, this is a vanilla cream soda. And they don't use any artificial flavors or preservatives. It's like old school, like natural sodas, like what you used to get in like the pharmacies and stuff in the 50s. And it's pretty good. It's pretty refreshing. Um, you can definitely tell it's not as sweet as most sodas, but pretty good. So I'm still waiting for some friends to catch up. Uh, so I'm gonna check out some other things and see what looks tasty. So I got an elk burger. We're gonna try this out. It looks very good. Does it? Yes, it does it now. <laughs> All right, so let's give this guy a shot. Oh, wait, no, elk me. burger. <laughs> That's all right, isn't it? Not bad. First thoughts? Yeah. 
Well, it is his Colorado, so I wouldn't expect it to be bad. I don't know if it's worth $10. I mean, if you don't want it, I Do you want to try a bite? Everything is expensive. They're all eating your $10 burger. That's all right. There. Chili cheese fries. Chili cheese fries. I'm so excited. What do you got? I've been left out. <laughs> Coney dog. What did you get? What kind of burger? Beef burger? Alright. This has chili in it. Yep. Go sit. Good beef? Alright. Orange creamsicle with people in the back. This is a mango. Nah, it's still in focus. This is a mango. Pina colada. Got mango. And mango. Yes, it's like mango, but it's pretty good. All right. That was the taste of Colorado. Uh, there wasn't as many weird foods as I'd like. Like, you'd think they'd have Rocky Mountain oysters at the Co Taste of Colorado, but I did not see any. Uh, but yeah, I had some good food, checked out some cool shops and things. It was a lot of fun. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, little outing with me. Uh, make sure you uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And also say hi to Spumoni. Spumoni! Hi! And I will see you guys later.